Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Yeah, so we're getting straight into it. So we're doing an acrylic redesign. I already fell down her previous set. Previous set has already been uploaded as well. So if you guys want to catch that. Also, the stone placement for this set is already uploaded too. Part one for this set is already uploaded. Ugh. Mm, sorry, y'all. Sorry, y'all. So right now, we're doing this whole nail full of clear. And we got some other mess going on. You feel me? All right. So next beat, drain it. Drop it. Tame the top. Tame the top. Seal it. Seal it. Seal it. And bring it on down. Bring it on down. Clean it up. Clean it up. Keep the shape. Yeah. Next beat. Drop it. Feather it. Keep the shape. Keep the shape. Keep the shape. And as you can see, I am moving my finger around and around just to make sure it's leveled. Making sure ain't no dips in the nail. You feel me? All right, so right now we're going to do a marble. The color I'm using is from the Chet. It's Hyped Up and raver girl they're both going to dark colors yeah look at that marble okay okay when i do marble i just smear it on a nail we're just gonna smear it we're gonna mix the color with some clear and we're just gonna smear it and hope hope for the best hope for the best right here we're gonna do an ombre i'm barely draining the nail barely wiping off the brush and then i'll be wondering why the brush is acting funky? Y'all see all that acrylic still on that brush? Looking crazy. All right, another marble. Put on the nail. Swirl it around. Make it do what it need to do. All right. One more. All right. At the top. Tame it. Swirl it around. Yes, ma'am. All right, now we finna ombre. Ombre my two pinks together. Bring it on down. Drop it. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Simple stuff, y'all. Simple stuff. I can see it was a little clear. It wasn't as opaque as I wanted it to be, so I had to put these beads down just to clean it up. All right, all right, all right. Now it's time to encapsulate. We got to encapsulate our marble nails. And also this ombre, but I kind of like to start encapsulating after the nail cures a little bit. Because, yeah. And then I added some glitter. This glitter is from a pack I got on Amazon. It's just a little pink glitter. Give it some razzle-dazzle. Nothing too much. I really should have did this last. Only because there, I just put it directly on my ombre. Pissed me the fuck off. Oh, sorry. Don't, I don't mean to cuss like that, but that just pissed me off. So, yeah, we're going to tame it, tame it, tame it. We're going to bring it on down, bring it on down. Get on the drill. All right, drain it, drop it. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Bring it on down, bring it on down. Keep that shape, baby. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Simple. All right, next beat. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Push it up, push it up. Clean it up, clean it up. For some odd reason, I just felt like my acrylic was super loose this day. It's probably because I'm using Mia Secret Monomer. So, I don't know. It tends to make the acrylic more runny, to be honest. But it's cheap, so <laughs> I'm going to make it do what it do, baby. Period. All right. Had to put another bead down to cover up some of that glitter I put on her nail. So, yeah. Yep, clean it up. Keep the shape. Capsulate. Drop it. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Something in there. We're going to bring it on down. Bring it on down. Keep that shape. Smooth it out. Smooth it out. All right, next beat. Drain it. Drop it. Tame it. Clean it up. Clean it up. Bring it on down. Bring it on down. Simple. It could all be so simple. Mm-hmm. Next beat. Drain it. Drop it. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Clean it up. Clean it up. 
clean it up, y'all. Bring it on down, bring it on down. I think I need to buy me a new um, coarse bit for when I am drilling off all of the acrylic because it's, it's taking me too long. I need it to be like five minutes on each hand. That's it. That's all I got to spare is five minutes. And then we need to get started with the prepping and priming. Okay? Sunny period. All right. Let's go, let's go, let's go. She didn't break any nails. None of her nails were lifting. And it was three weeks in total. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Bring it on down. She wasn't missing any diamonds either. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. I will link I will link her previous set in the description. It is like you know, Miss Day Two, Day Three, something, Day Four. It's up there, but I'll link it in the bottom so you guys can see. All right, now it's time to do the glitter nails. All right, the glitter I'm using is pink cotton candy, pink starburst, pink starburst. I think. But it wasn't pink enough, so I did add in some of the glitter that I used on my marbles just to give it more of a pink vibe. So, yeah. And when y'all know when I do them glitter nails, I just be trying to put the glitter on the nail. Least I can do. Only thing I can do. Sorry, I got quiet. Sorry. All right. Drop it. Tame it, tame it, tame it, and bring it on down, bring it on down. We are encapsulating the glitter. Drain it. Drop it. Tame it, tame it, tame it. Seal it, seal it, seal it. Bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down, bring it on down. Yes, ma'am. Mm-hmm. And once again, guys, if these videos are too fast you can just slow them down using the um settings and then going to speed and you'll be able to slow the video down because i'll be speeding the videos up i truly do now we're gonna get a little a little boomerang or something because the encapsulation looks lovely lovely all right look at there there we go Looks lovely. Time to get back to it, though. This is an 8080 grit hand file from Tulip Deals. I got the white one. I usually get the zebra, and I don't like this white one. I feel like I was working way too freaking hard. Like, for real, for real. Oh, my God. I feel like I was working too hard. But y'all know the drill. We're going to tailor it in, taper it in. We're going to do our thing. We're going to do our due diligence. And we're going to make sure that nail is fitting on the finger. We don't need no size three nails. Okay? We don't need that. Okay? Each nail needs to be fitting to the finger. So take your time. All right? Take your time. There's no rush. No rush. Reshape, reshape, hit them corners, get them dips, get rid of all that. Here come the train. Hopefully it's a small train. All right, train. All right, so yeah. Now we're going get another boomerang. Because we got to update these folks on the process. All right, reshape, reshape. You know, because right there with a tip and a natural nail are, it tends to expand a little bit. So we need to taper that in some, just like that. Taper it in and get them size right. Get them size right. And also, considering that this was an acrylic redesign, uh, sometimes the tips themselves kind of lose their shape. So I try not to reshape them. I just kind of put the acrylic on there and we just going to have to low-key build the nail from there. So, yeah, that's my goal. Just to make sure I'm not missing nothing. Make sure my shape ain't off and all this other stuff. I'm using my Melody Susie Scarlet E-File with a sanding band. Hit them cuticles. Cut down some of that bulk. Yes, ma'am. Take off the scratches from the hand file. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
We're going to go around that cuticle, cut down some of that bulk. Yes, ma'am. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. And we're going to keep um, tailoring in the sides. Yes, ma'am. It's the same thing every single time. Because consistency is key when it comes to doing nails. You got to get your own vibe. Can't steal my vibe. You got to find your own. I'm just here to guide y'all. Give y'all some pointers, some tips, some products, websites. And show y'all how I do it. That's it. Look at look at the side view on them nails. Look at the apexes on them nails. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful, baby. Beautiful. All right. Now we're going to take our... Uh, it's not a tapered bit. The one that I'm about to pull out is just a regular barrel bit. And it's extra fine. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, y'all. But that's going to be the end of the video after I do this. Because the, um, the rhinestone process is in a previous video from Nailmas. So with that being said, I hope y'all like this video. Comment subscribe y'all please subscribe please and i'll catch y'all next time for real and if you made it this far leave me the nail like the pink nail emoji y'all know what i'm talking about leave that down there in, in the comments because i really appreciate y'all and i am so thankful for nail miss period because we're having a good time over here because any period <laughs> but okay i'm gonna let y'all go I think we're finished. Make sure you dust the clients off. And here go the finished product. Bye.